Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. We are having a look at how to increase our population again. So we're just uh, doing one more episode of this. So there are a few more things we can do to help increase this population. So let's turn off the Hunter's Lodge because we have a ton of food because our farms are being upgraded. They, they're gonna have four plots soon. So there's gonna be a lot of food around, okay? So let's uh, just turn that off. That's six nuggets free to uh, help with the um, labor force, okay? And then all we're going to do, every couple of minutes, we're going to do Le Cupid, okay? Because we've got a bit of creator points as well. So let's couple up these nuggets. There's a couple more over here. Oh, there's a few actually. This is great. One more, come on. Beautiful, all right. So that's it, just five or six, and then they're gonna toddle off and um, go have babies, which is great for us, okay? Now, happy Monday, guys. It's been a busy week and busy weekend. So I hope you guys have been keeping entertained. So we're going to continue upgrading. So there's two more buildings here. So let's upgrade the engineer's hut and upgrade the restaurant. And as we're doing this, we're going to just keep an eye on our resources, okay? So planks and bricks are still pretty good. I'm um, just double checking. Um, we did have a wood refinery over here. We can turn off as well. So we're going to turn that off. Uh, bricks are around 260, so that's still good. But once it drops down under 200, we might turn one of these refineries on. Okay. Other than that, we're all good. All right. So we're going to do the Lecupid a couple more times. And we're going to hopefully get this uh, population up. So unemployment is above 100 now, so that is great. That means these uh, upgrades we're doing and construction to new buildings, they're going to happen very quickly, okay? Because there's just so many nuggets wandering around, okay? And they're not just doing nothing. They're coupling up because we do have 37 unmarried. So they're going on dates, they're making babies, all the stuff we want them to do, okay? Um, I did also want to do a weather tower out this way because when we turn the siren on it doesn't um kind of make any noise out here so i'm pretty sure it's not a thing that well I, i'm pretty sure when you do the siren all nuggets hear it anyway but it's just a cosmetic thing i think so there we go that's great um i would not be surprised if these buildings are okay I spoke too soon. No one's brought any res uh, resources yet. Very slack. Excellent. All right, so we are pretty close to modern age. We just need industrialization to uh, kick in. And then we're in the modern age. So I've decided God create a power wise. It's a modern era. It's not totally space area okay so it's just a modern era so i think we might just uh take down ufos that's it so any of these major uh disasters we're not going to help with anymore so if a tornado hits uh bad luck they're gonna have to rebuild same with meteors so we will have to be on our game to actually sound the alarm so our nuggets do go to bunkers. And that's the only way we're going to have to um, save our nuggets. And yeah, infected zones, they're going to have to deal with that themselves. Um, yeah, so that's, that's the plan. And then once we hit space age, we do nothing. By then, we will have the defense towers upgraded, so they'll take out UFOs themselves. And I think 
I think we will also implement all ministers uh, during the modern era, okay? So we've been holding off with the defense and the power minister. We can implement these other two uh, because they, they go crazy. They go absolutely crazy, but the, you know what? They're governing for themselves. They're going to be defending themselves, so we'll allow that, okay? All right. I think it's almost winter, so we could probably do a few of these farms soon. Let's keep upgrading. Now, there's a random... Well, it's not random. We're actually going to build out this way, okay? This is where our modern industry is going to be uh, set up. So, let's upgrade this engineer's hut. And let's do another building, which isn't a farm. This is looking really good out here. Um, clearly, there's going to be more to upgrade soon. Once we hit modern. Here we go. We've got a cemetery. So, wow, that's a lot of dead people. Let's upgrade that. Now, how's our resources going? Iron is fine. We do have one iron mine still operating. So, that's slowly keeping that uh, number there. Cement is still good. 170. Gas and glass is off, but... There's plenty. And then, yeah. Planks and bricks are fantastic. So, it's fine to shut down a bit of industry now and then. Especially to help uh, push up your population. Now, I think we need a defense tower out here. Only because I have been noticing some wolf attacks coming from this way. So let's pop that there. That's a great spot, I think. And then we do have some meteors we could pick up, possibly. Get some chests. Get some extra resources, maybe. Now, we did add six subscriber nuggets. Um, so they might pop up. We might be able to... Oh, there's one already. Look at that. Who's this? Joshua Eplin, there you go. You're 15, so you're, you're kicking on. Uh, you do have a partner, but no children yet. So let's hope that changes. We want to keep your you into the game. Anyone else? I remember someone uh, being out in one well, of the defense towers out here. Have they still got their job? Or have they upgraded themselves? They're not there. Uh, no. Oh, yes, Jane. There we go. Jane Havano. Havano, yeah. Beautiful. We can actually uh, zoom in. What are they doing? Oh. When you see a hut are there two subscribers that are coupled up? What is going on in here? They are! Oh my god, it's a scandal. It's an absolute scandal. Wow. Okay, well, someone's surname's going to continue on. One's going to be removed. I apologize. Uh, that has never happened. Wow. Well, congratulations, guys. Congratulations. Okay, let's have a look at... Uh, how we're looking okay so winter is almost here the rain is turning into snow this restaurant and engineer's hut has been upgraded so let's keep going this is fantastic uh okay they're angry with us they could attack us or they could attack someone else okay uh how's this looking no resources here yet this guy's probably dropping something off Ah, uh, he did. He dropped some glass off. It is a fair hike out, so that's understandable. Then we have the uh, forecast tower being built here. And then I believe there was a cemetery. Where's the cemetery? Right here. Is that right? Yeah. So that just needs iron. So we'll keep, we'll keep building. That's fine. So we'll go with a hospital. 
And we're not prioritizing, so the Nuggets are just casually getting resources here. Um, if they still need to go mate or couple up with someone, they can still do it. It's not prioritized, so that's fine. It's uh, great that our volcano has decided to go for a little sleep. Uh, it was raining a bit of destruction down, right? So, not good. Uh, how are you guys enjoying the Space Age? Um, I actually haven't done any of the Space Age content yet. Even, like, on the channel or in my personal game. Uh, I just haven't got there yet. Um, there are some bugs, but... They have been uh, fixed. So what I'll do, I'll pop up on the screen now uh, the bugs that have been reported and are being fixed by Crytivo. I believe there's already been a patch that was released last week and then there's another one coming out pretty soon or it's already out by now. So there we go. They are on the case. Um, but yeah, I'm very excited to get to, uh, get to the moon. All right, wolf attack. Let's sound the alarm. Because these guys have been splitting up their attack, haven't they? There they are. They are coming directly to here. All of them. Wow, and we didn't have that defense tower up. All we have is a police out here. The army might take a while to get out here. But we did sound the siren, so the... Here comes the police. He's not going to survive. He's going to take out a couple, maybe. Oh, absolute savagely. Just totally destroyed. Okay, there's a couple. No, he, they're just gone to finish off the job. Oh, uh, another copper. Go on, mate. Go on, mate. Oh, he sacrificed himself. Oh, is there any, any more police? Oh, no. Uh, we've got a subscriber in the uh, bunker. That's great. Oh, there's another police officer. Okay, they're running off. Wow. All right, so three nuggets died. I think a bit more, to be honest. Come on, mate. You can take out this last guy. Yes, this one is running for his life. Excellent. Well, we lost a few police officers. Oh, look, he's going to get taken out. Oh, no, he's, he's really... He's really getting away, isn't he? There we go. Let's turn that off. Oh, no, he's out. He is out. The army got there in the end. Good on you guys. Okay. A little bit of excitement there. And they'll run back to the bunker. I apologize, the barracks. Now I have not seen the modern day barracks just in as concept art, right? So it'd be interesting to see that as well. And we really want to fix our border up because I think we're a little bit too close here. We'll see what happens. Um, they are, who's attacking who? These guys are attacking either me or the other other guys. Uh, they are friends with us, so one would assume they'll attack these guys. But we saw what happened last week. It just bounced off their dome and, and ended up attacking us. So Not the best result. Now also, guys, on Wednesday, I have a bonus video coming out. It is uh, called The Wandering Village. It's a, a demo on Steam at the moment. It's in early access, but it's it's almost ready for release. It looks very interesting. Um, I've been watching a few guys and girls on YouTube play the game. So I thought we'll just uh, take a look at it. It looks very interesting. The artwork and just the whole uh, concept of the game is uh, new and exciting, so I thought we'll check that out. Okay, let's upgrade this cemetery. This bad boy gets destroyed almost all the time by the volcano. 
let's upgrade that. Uh, what's been there? That's a cemetery. So, oh wow, it's all happening. Oh, there we go. We're out of industrialized. We're into the industrialization period. So a lot of resources are going to slowly go down now because they do use it a bit of resource for residential and you are all residential going to slowly upgrade to the modern age so we really need that high unemployment rate as well so let's uh couple up some more nuggets because that that final population amount isn't really uh budging much is it and let's just do these two okay because we have plenty of creator points. Uh, we don't need a discovery points at the moment. We're pretty good. Let's check our research out. We will move forward. We want to get uh, into the modern age. So all this is brand new, right? Some of these research uh, nodes are old ones like uh, the chemical factory the oil factory or the fuel factory but they're just positioned differently now so very exciting all right let's uh research the steel factory very important we can upgrade the cement factory to modern and upgrade reservoir and pumps oh wow this is gonna be very busy very busy and let's do the bridge we could probably use one or two bridges help our nuggets uh, maneuver around these lakes all right well that that's uh that's all happening there we go we've got modern era intergalactic black market it's all happening let's do some farms let's do some farms um let's just do these two upgrade and upgrade okay because as as we upgrade these restaurants they need more food so we need to produce more food and we we have a ton we have a ton uh two and a half minutes left until we see what happens with this tornado and we have an earthquake coming as well so it's all happening uh this is bloody beautiful like i said guys uh this is kind of the stagnant period in the game like getting out of stone age takes a bit because you don't have a lot of nuggets to do a lot of uh construction and then uh medieval there's just so much research to do and in correspondence to that is upgrading buildings and constructing new buildings, uh, gathering new resources, and it just takes, it takes a while. I could always up the speed, but I don't know. There's always, there's always something to do. There's always something to talk about. So, and there we go. Our exiles are upgrading themselves as well. Excellent. But yeah, there's the moon. We're going to get there soon. Um, I have seen a little bit of gameplay on YouTube with the moon and uh, people colonizing it and stuff. So it's I'm very excited to get there. And you know what? By the time we do get there on a ch as the channel... Um, all the bugs and stuff should be sorted out, right? So we should have a crisp, clean experience. So, all right. Now we did do these new uh, wind turbines. Um, I think we should probably do some new batteries soon. Get another big battery park happening. With moving into the modern age, we'll probably even need to do more wind turbines to be honest we'll probably do that in the next episode okay 
So yeah, a lot, a lot happening now. Residential, just gonna keep popping up new modern buildings. Here we go, we got our first modern residential here. And no one lives in it. Of course, of course. All right, we're safe. But really, how safe are we? How safe are we? Um, there's a tornado. And it should just bounce off the uh, dome and off it goes. I have found a bug. I'm not sure if it's been fixed by now. But if a tornado comes across the water and you do a dome and the dome is across the water and the tornado hits the dome, it gets stuck there. It doesn't actually bounce off. Wow, they've got a new temple. That is bigger and stronger. Let's trade with them because we... Our, re our industry is shut down for the moment. Look at this. This is why you're kind of... I know it's fun to absolutely destroy an exile village and wipe them off the map. But look at all of this resource we can uh, trade with them. That if we had destroyed them, we wouldn't be able to get. We've only got one other exile village and they might not be trading this stuff. So always a handy hint. Always a handy hint. Let's just double check this tornado. It is! Look, see? Oh my god. These exiles are so... I, I don't know. There's no words to explain. There really is not. Again, they were almost about to destroy us. You absolute donkeys. Absolute donkeys. And look how big their dome is that it's taking our tower. So, yeah, we're going to have to rearrange, rearrange our borders, I think, unfortunately. All right, so this engineer's hut's been upgraded. We're out of winter. How are we looking over here with these two new farms? Uh, they are up and running. So we can keep going in between doing all this uh, residential buildings. Actually, we're looking pretty good. We do have some new upgrades coming though. So let's do this uh, restaurant and this engineer's hut. Okay. And then yeah, these two were done. Uh, we did the cemetery. Where's the cemetery? It's around here somewhere. Yeah, right there. So we're kind of making our way out this way. And then we also, so we've got all this to upgrade. We've got these buildings to upgrade. Plus, we have uh, over near this other mountain, all of this to upgrade. So, you know what? This could actually be, like, the country. And we'll just slowly upgrade it when we need it, I think. I think that might be the plan. Let's do some trees out here. This is absolutely bare. And these nuggets, they just chop trees down willy-nilly. Um, it's really annoying, to be honest. We have two... Lumber camps. I don't understand why they keep going around chopping trees down. Anyway. And look, yeah, we can just... We need more here. We need to increase that e ecology for sure. Alright, that's enough. That, that was a lot of creator points just used up then. Okay, resource-wise... Let's see if we can trade. We would love a bit of wood. Everything else is really good. We could get some more iron. That's just hovering nicely, you know. We're, we're using a bit for upgrading, but we're producing enough in that one mine just to just to keep us there, okay? Um, okay, garage. I did have three. I had... We built one. And then... We had two more on hold. Now, 
This one, I think, has been removed because this was upgraded. So, let's do that. We sh can we still sneak it in here is the question. This is, this is where it was, right? I'm sure of it. Uh, we might have to move it, to be honest. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was around here somewhere, right? Oh, that cloud system. Get out of the way. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was here. Oh, look, we can put it there. Let's do that. How that doesn't take out the road is a mystery. And then, yeah, we've got, we got one over here. Nope, that's the one that's built. We had one over here, right? Yeah, right there. So we can unpause that now. Cool. Because at the moment, we only have 100 nuggets with cars, and we have 300. Just over 300. That has dropped dramatically. What have what has happened there? We do have we do have a lot of unmarried, but unemployment's dropped by what 10, 15? It must be the upgrading of buildings because you usually open an extra worker slot, so maybe that's the issue. I am so surprised that this total nugget population has not jumped. Hmm, interesting. Uh, let's Le Cupid. Okay. Is, is this not working? What's going on here? There we go. Excellent. Even though there's 60... I'm struggling to find any. Ah, oh, that's good for the moment. Okay, I think we can upgrade a couple more and then we might finish up there. Again, guys, I apologize if this wasn't too exciting, but we, we just need to get... We're, we're right on the cuff of modern era. Once we get into it, it gets a bit more exciting, especially with all these new resources. We need to organize chemicals, electronics, steel beams, plastics and fuel. So a lot is going to happen very soon. Okay. Now let's upgrade these last two buildings here. Restaurant and engineer's hut. And you know what? What we can do in the next episode is, well, when we when we upgrade engineer huts into the modern era, their sphere of influence is going to be so great that we may be able to remove one or two and just free up some nuggets there. So, all right. Well, the de defense tower's finished. That's great. That's an added defense there. We've just got a couple buildings out here to upgrade. Um, and then over over there to the left, we're going to leave uh, all these buildings around the mountain. We're going to leave them for the moment. This is going to be our little country area. Um, but we're going to upgrade everything else. And then as you can see, a whole lot of new modern residential popping up. We have the Ministry for Health. So let's implement them. That's great. And then let's have a look at our research. Once we get to... Where does Space Age actually start? Okay. I think it starts around here with the rocket and everything. Yeah, Lunar Colony. I'm guessing this is where Space Age starts. So, kind of halfway would be... You know what? When, once we start researching these three arms, we'll implement all ministers. And then they can just go crazy. They can do whatever they want. Okay? 
all right we're looking good and yeah just a lot you know what that's why our population's so low i reckon because all these nuggets are off upgrading residential like three nuggets per site right that could be a possibility see there's, there's another one that's nine nuggets plus we got two or three constructions happening that's uh, another nine nuggets so and like I said every upgrade we do opens up one extra worker slot so we're taken away from there so but as a whole 335 that's a, that's not bad let's do the cupid just before we leave we want to get look at the children 23 let's let's try and increase that uh we'll just do this a couple of times yeah we can celebrate religious focus i was not aware there was an election on but that's great That's excellent. Let's uh, finish up there. We've got the fireworks happening. Let's zoom out. Oh, our beautiful planet. We're entering the modern era. It's going to get very busy very quickly, guys. So thanks for watching. I hope you liked the video. Just a little bit more uh, tips for population growth. We shut down a hunter's lodge. We didn't need it. Look at our food. Two, uh, 680. So there's always some sort of injury we can shut down and help boost our labor force. And then, uh, yeah, Le Cupid is probably our best bet at the moment because we've done everything else. We've shut down other industries. It's going to get exciting. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you Wednesday for that new video. Take care. Bye.